I'm the only one on the stage that said we should not go into Iraq. Are you for invading Iraq? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, you know, I wish it was. I, I wish the first time it was done correctly. I'm very pro-life. I'm very pro-choice. Do you believe in punishment for abortion? Yes or no? Is a principle. There has to be some form of punishment. I am pro-choice in every respect. She has no natural talent to be president. She's very talented, and she has a husband that I also like very much. Hillary Clinton was the worst Secretary of State in the history of the United States. Hillary Clinton, how did she do as Secretary of State? Probably above and beyond everybody else. Let's say Hillary is president. I, oh. Hillary Clinton, I think, is a terrific woman. I think she really works hard, and I think she does a good job, and I like her. I will build the wall and Mexico is going to pay for it and they'll be happy to pay for it. I'm not going to pay for that fucking wall. This guy used a filthy, disgusting word on television and he should be ashamed of himself and he should apologize, okay? Listen, you motherfuckers. We'll you motherfuckers. I'm going to bomb the shit out of them. We'll beat the shit out of them. Political bullshit. You're not going to raise that fucking price, you understand? Donald, true or false, you've said the government should pay for everyone's health care. That's false. You've never That's said false. that. Everybody's got to be covered. Universal health care. I am going to take care of everybody. Well, who pays for it? The government's going to pay for it, but we're going to save so much money on the other side. He said I was in favor of Libya. I was, I never discussed that subject. I was in favor of Libya. We would be so much better off if Gaddafi were in charge right now. Gaddafi in Libya is killing thousands of people. We should go in, we should stop this guy, which would be very easy and very quick. Stop him from doing it and save these lives. They're here illegally. You take them, they have to go back. We have to show some compassion. You're right, we just right. can't throw everybody out. They have so to you're going to split up families. Chuck. You're going to deport children. Chuck, no, no. We're going to keep the families together. We have to keep the families together. But you're going to keep them they together have to out. Go. But they have to go. How do you throw somebody out that's lived in this country for 20 years? North Korea has nukes. Japan has a problem with that. I mean, they have a big problem with it. Maybe they would, in fact, be better off if they defend themselves from North Korea. Maybe with we nukes. would be better off. Including with nukes, yes, including with nukes. And they said, I want Japan to nuke. I want Japan to get nuclear weapons. Give me a break. But if you say to Japan, yes, it's fine, you get nuclear weapons, South Korea, you as well, and Saudi Arabia says we can want I, them to. Can too. I be honest with you? It's going to happen anyway. So it's only a question of time. I'm a conservative person. The Republicans are just too crazy right. I mean, just what's going on is just nuts. Bush says, Bush says, I do not believe he's a true conservative. These people are stupid. Do you identify more as a Democrat or a Republican? In many cases, I probably identify more as a Democrat. The economy does better under the Democrats than the Republicans. I don't know anything about David Duke, okay? I don't know anything about what you're even talking about with uh, white supremacy or white supremacists. What do you see as the biggest problem with the Reform Party right now? Well, you've got David Duke just joined. A bigot, a racist a problem. I mean, this is not exactly the people you want in your party. Wages too high. We're not going to be able to compete against the world. I hate to say it, but we have to leave it the way it is. I don't know how people make it on $7.25 an hour. I would like to see an increase of some magnitude. Do you believe voters have a right to see your tax returns before they make a final decision? I don't think they do. If I decide to run for office, I'll produce my tax returns, absolutely. There have been many presidents that have not shown their tax returns. Uh, actually, every single nominee since 1976 has released right, their tax but before returns. What exactly is your relationship with Vladimir Putin? I have no relationship with Putin. Do you have a relationship with Vladimir Putin, a conversational relationship, or anything that you feel you have sway or influence over his government? I do have a relationship, and I can tell you that he's very interested in what we're doing here today. He's probably very interested in what you and I are saying today, and I'm sure he's going to be seeing it in some form. But I do have a relationship with him. I never met Putin. I don't know who Putin is. He said one nice thing about me. He said, I'm a genius. I said, thank you very much to the newspaper. And that was the end of it. I never met Putin. And I spoke indirectly and directly with President Putin, who could not have been nicer. 
I have no relationship with Putin. I don't think I've ever met him. Never spoken to him I've on the phone? I've been in Moscow. I didn't meet him in Moscow. Where? Never spoken to him on the phone? Uh, I have never spoken to him on the phone, no. I have nothing to do with Russia. I told you. I have no deals there. You know, I was in Moscow a couple of months ago. I owned the Miss Universe pageant. And they treated me so great. Putin even sent me a present. Beautiful present with a beautiful note. I don't know Putin. I have I'm no not, I'm not idea. Asking, I'm asking I never met Putin. This is not my best friend.